My name is Anders Jensen. Today we will talk with Alan Zimmerman, the founder of OpenRPA. He will help us solve the RPA challenge in OpenRPA. OpenRPA is a open source RPA tool. It's free to use. And this uh, solve, solving this is a part of a bigger NGO I did with Alan. I will make it online in the next couple of weeks when I edit it. And uh, so for now, we will see him uh, solve this RPA challenge. So let's get right to it. So Alan, um, uh, there's this RPA challenge uh, online. I don't know if you can head to RPA challenge. Uh, yeah, here. And what this is, is it's uh, several uh, kinds of challenges that uh, you can solve with your RPA tool. And we could try mm -hmm. to solve this maybe with open RPA or you, you created a solution for us actually. So can you take us through that solution? So we, we can create it if you want, or we can just go through the example that I created. We can just yeah. go through it or, uh, yeah. But we, can, we take so, each, so, can we take each step? So if I want to build this myself with open RPA, so can you take us uh, through from the first step to the, to the last step and just yes. explaining what you're doing? So first of all, we need to download an Excel file with a list of addresses, names, email addresses, and companies, and so on. Yeah. So I'm using the download file activity to download that file into documents. Mm -hmm. Then I open the Excel file and read all the content into a data table. Yeah. And just to make everything fast, I then click the start button to run the challenge. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then I go into a for each where I read each row in the Excel file that we just downloaded. Yeah, I think I, and, I, so I actually saw this myself in UiPath and I think that was, that was the same approach I took. So that's, yeah, that makes sense. Okay. It's quite- So then we need to find the different, uh, the different fields here. And, mm -hmm. and that's where I'm a little bit different from what most people do inside UiPath. Yeah. So UiPath has this concept of anchor points. So, so the main idea is that you want to find the element using an anchor point uh, inside UiPath, but I don't have that concept. So the way that I find the, the, the specific fields is that each field, well, wrong button, each field inside this page, this is, uh, for instance, if I want to find address, mm -hmm. you will notice that it has an attribute, uh, where did I find it? I didn't find it, there we go. It has an attribute called, it's a field called ng reflect name mm -hmm. that contains the name of the specific field that we want. Mm -hmm. So I clicked, I used the recorder to click each of these fields and then I changed the selector to look for ng reflect name instead of the ID, which is the default for finding an element on a web page. Yeah. And then for each of these, I then assign whatever I get from that yeah. row inside the Excel, Excel fields. Yeah. Exactly. So this is where I fill out company name, first name, last name, and so on. I just go through all the different fields and then mm -hmm. I end up clicking the submit button and we yeah. go through the next row. Yeah. Um, so quite easy. It's just a little annoying picking out the different fields, but besides that, it's, it's quite easy. Should we Be try and run it? Yeah, before, um, I'll say that I, I will not tell you how fast I did it, but do you think you're faster or slower than me? I got a time on this, so um, do you think you can beat me or do you think you're slower? I don't think I can beat you. That, okay. that's... We try. <laughs> and then I, <laughs> I will tell you if you beat me afterwards, okay? Okay. Yeah, we can just... Uh, so, so um, yeah. Sorry about that. No worries. So, there we go. Yeah. So you did it in 1.9 second, is that right? Yes. Uh, I mean, I, you beat me by an inch. I mean, I was only, I think it was 70 seconds. <laughs> it took me 70, se 70 seconds. So that's over a minute for me. And how fast can you do it? Is it really two seconds? Wow, that's really fast, Alan. Can you can you can we try two two takes more just to see how if it's that fast every time? Of course it is. Sure. We can try to break our own record. Yeah, let's run it again. So it's like one point nine second. You can do it. That's really really fast, Alan. 
as I say, my, my record was over a minute, and I thought that okay. uh, we could battle it out, but uh, yeah, we couldn't really. Maybe I should try the solution in Open RPA. Now we've seen. Uh, I would love now, that. Now we've seen you going through it. I might make a video and see if I can make a, make it quicker with Open RPA than one point. What is it? One point nine? Our record was your record with Open RPA was. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 